Oh my goodness, who's that? What? Special guest. Special guest to Nicholas, man. Yeah. He's going to eat some peppers. It's going to be wild. Painful. I don't, don't know why he agreed to do this. He's not typically the guy that likes to eat no. the peppers. No, I'm going to be but in pain. I don't think these are hot, probably. They'll be hot for you. They're probably hot for me. But they're not like super hot peppers. No. So um, we're looking at two different peppers today, even though we have a lot of different peppers on the on the plate here. I don't know if you can even see that on camera. I'll try to get some better pictures. Um, but two of the plants we have, uh, Inca Red Drop has made, I mean, 50 of these little peppers that we just picked off. I've been chopping them up, putting them in stuff, giving them to people at work. Uh, these are kind of smaller examples, I guess, really. They usually get twice the size of this, but for some reason, I just have two little itty bitty red ones. Um, the plant has some more. It, it's got 50 peppers on it, still making lots of them. Um, and then these are supposedly some Chinese five color peppers. Um, from the pictures I've seen, the five color ones usually are solid purple. These have never got solid purple. They've been green with the yellow. They've gone to the yellow, orange, and then red. So I'll try to get some better pictures of those as well. But we're gonna start with the Inca Red Drop. And we're going to cut it in half and we'll just eat a half. That way I can cut it open and we can get a picture of what the seeds look like on the inside. And uh, we can go from there. So I'm just going to cut the end off. Actually, I'll just cut them in half. This is the dullest knife in the world. So we'll cut them in half. And I'm just going to get a picture of what the seeds look like so that I can put that on uh, the video. But that's what he looks like on the inside. So. I don't know. You want some of this? Yeah. You want the seeds or the little bit of seeds? A little bit of seeds. Oh, yeah. So there's a little half for you. Mm -hmm. I'll just eat a little half myself, you know. It's they, These are spicy, but I don't think that they're deadly. I don't know about you. I like I mean, it smells like pepper. It smells a little hot. I don't know. Mine you smell like bell peppers. You ready? Ooh. It's hot, huh? You got some heat. Yeah. <laughs> Blazing? Uh. He's a hot little guy, huh? He's probably like as hot as like a hot jalapeno. Like not like a mild jalapeno, but like if you get a jalapeno and you're like, damn, that jalapeno was hot. That's kind of like what this little Inca Red Drop tastes like to me. But they have so many seeds for their size. They're like cooking with them is tough you know you got to put all the seeds in there or if you're picking out all the seeds it's just hard so I don't know is it kind of going away or still burning uh, still burning not as bad as initially it had like a large boss so a few seconds after and then it's just kind of chilled out yeah they they don't like grow or get worse no. like some Carolina Reapers or ghost peppers seem to do like you're like for five minutes, it kills you. Your eyes are getting a little red. Yeah. It's hot, huh? Yeah. Hot for you. Yeah. Special guest to Nicholas, being a trooper, the guy doesn't eat hot stuff. Mm -mm. Uh, and so now for the Chinese five color ones. Um, I don't know how these will be since we already just ate like a kind of spicy pepper. Sometimes like if you eat another one that's a little less spicy, but it's still spicy, what's already hot in your mouth is hotter than what you're eating. So I don't, I think these are about the same heat. Um, so, I don't know. What should we do? The yellow and the red one or the red one? When they're red, they're fully ripe. Uh, yellow and red. We'll do the yellow. All right. So, this guy, too. We'll get a picture of him. I'll pick the wrong knife for today, for sure. Professional photographer. Oh, wow. Camera's not working too well today. It's so dark. But this guy has a lot of seeds in him too. You see all them seeds? Yeah. Just crazy. So just cooking with them, yeah, it's hard. My shirt's all bunched up on me. So get this little green guy off of there. 
scrape out a couple of the seeds, I guess. Because it's like half seed. So, I don't know, there you go. What do you think of this guy? He smells less hot to me. Yeah. He smells like a sweet pepper would smell almost. Yeah, like bell pepper. So, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I swallowed. Ah. So he's a hot one too, huh? I swallowed and it hit me. In the throat or what? Yeah. So he's got a little bit different heat, kind of. That that Inca red drop kind of like burned my like lips and stuff. This guy kind of burns like the back of the throat a little bit. I don't I don't know what the difference is. I'm just losing it. <laughs> hey. Oh, they're hot. But I think he's probably just about as hot as the Inca Red Drop one is, too. Yeah. They, they kind of seem like they're the same heat, whether they're yellow and orange or all the way red. You know, even these little guys pack some fire to them. So, uh, I don't know, just a quick video. Nobody else is home. No. So you're the only victim <laughs> we had to eat peppers with. Um, but thanks for Nick for showing up, eating some peppers, breaking out of his comfort zone the shallow video games we'll be we'll be uh eating ghost peppers in no time so i don't know that's it you got anything to say no no all no. right good deal yeah <laughs> we'll see you on the next one you guys have fun today go drink some milk yeah <laughs>